What's up everybody? It's your girl Desha Desha Pace and I'm here today this afternoon I'm gonna be cooking some pig feet and pig ears. I have like three pig feet three pig well it's one and a half pig feet and I have about five or six pig ears that have been soaking. Hey y'all. <laughs> there go your girl rain. They've been soaking. I've cleaned them or soaked them in some salt water for about an hour, dumped them, then I got them soaking in some white vinegar. And they've been soaking there for about a half an hour. So stay tuned, y'all. Let's see. Make sure this water's cold. I've actually took a straight razor, a straight blade, to get any excess hair that I felt or saw on the pig feet and pig ears. So I'm just rinsing them. I'm going to dump this water some more, y'all. Rain, do you have to come down the stairs like that? Bye. Rain, come down the stairs. It sounds like it's five kids, and it's just her. Just making sure y'all got all this salt and vinegar off. I know y'all don't want to see this whole process. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Here's my pot. Here is my pig ears and pig feet. Actually, y'all, it's just one. It's one and a half. One whole trotter split in half and another half of another whole trotter. So I have my pot that I'm going to use. Now this process is going to take about <clears throat> four hours, give or take. So what I'm going to do right now is put my pig feet. See, I told y'all it was split in half. That's how I bought it from the market. I'm going to put all three at the bottom. They've been washed, clean, rinse, washed, clean, rinse. Now I'm adding the pig ears. On top. Not that it's going to stay that way. I'm going to turn me some cold water on. Me and Mr. T, we were talking. I was like, baby, don't I have, um, don't we have some pictures? He was like, yeah, we used to have about two. I can't find no pictures. But anyway, and that's for my cold water. This here is jalapenos, red bell pepper, green bell pepper, and some celery. I have these little petite little onions I was showing y'all the other day. I don't know if I'm going to buy them again. But I'm about to dump all of this over in this pot. Just like that. I'm going to drop these onions. I have two. I have six. Six of those little onions. I'm not going to bother to cut them in half. I'm not. Here I have one packet of Saison. This is my seasoning, y'all. One packet of Saison, some parsley, some oregano, some red cayenne pepper, black pepper, and what I have left of the seasoning salt. All right, let's rock and roll. We're going to pour it on over in here. Now, I got this pot going on of six and a half, seven, and I'm about to get some cold water. And what we want to do is, my measuring cup is only two cups. So, bear with me. And what we want to do, we want to cover the meat. So that's two cups of water, y'all. So that's one, two cups. Like I said, I don't know what happened to my picture. 
It might be up in my little cubby hole, but I'm not looking for it. That's two. So that makes four cups of water right there. This is three, but I want to get my seasonings out of here, out of this container that I used. All right. I'm going to do one more cup. This is it. That's the water. Let me show you. I'll bring it a little bit closer. It's not really stirring it up. I just want to make sure the meat is underneath the water, which it, which it is. Get these seasonings around in here. All right, we're going to let that do what it do. I'm going to take my handy dandy lid and cover it. It has some air. This actually doesn't fit this pot which is good so that way some air can escape so that way well it's not going to overflow because my pot is big and we're going to let this cook for about three and a half four hours but what i'm going to do y'all i'm going to come back to y'all within about an hour and show y'all what's going on y'all stay tuned in dasha's kitchen okay fam it hasn't been quite an hour yet but that's what the pot is looking like and one other thing I forgot to tell y'all is that once this cooks down, this water and these pig ears get tender, tender, I'm going to make a slurry, which is like a gravy I'm going to add. And I will show y'all the process. Maybe, maybe not. Well, I've showed y'all before, but it's going to consist of flour and water. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some of this juice from this pot, from this pot, and I'm going to take this juice and use that as the base because I don't want to add any more water but y'all stay tuned okay y'all as y'all can see I'm back once again I got some water these trotters and these pig ears is still cooking And y'all know, I like this product. Dry is going. Y'all know, I like that. That rice. I do. I do eat white, white rice. Let me get a little bit of butter. turn this down we got this pot on about an eight let's turn this down to about a six all right y'all everything is like done Woo. I'm gonna turn it up turn it off this is some jerk rice I'm about to burn my fingers Rice is done. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna taste that for y'all. Alright. Yeah, you can see that. 
here is the pig feet and pig ears. All right, let me get me a little sampler. You can get a little bit of rice. Because it's time for me to go to bed. A little bit of rice. Let me see. Uh, I think. Okay, I'm going to take a piece of little pit of the And here is a pig ear with some juice. Let me take that. I only have but a saucer full. Oh, well, anyway, I got some pig ears and pig feet with some jerk rice. Y'all stay tuned. Let's see. That's good. Let me see if I can cut this pig here with this this spoon. Oh yeah. I was able to cut it y'all with this spoon. I know what that means. It's nice and tender. Mmm. I don't care what y'all say. Here's another piece. It's the same ear. But it was overlapping. I'm about to cut it in half with this spoon. Here it is, y'all. With some rice. Mm, 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 mm. Y'all, I got a little piece of um pig foot right here, pig feet. It's hot. But I just spit out the bone. And that's it. Oh my. That's a pear. Rice. Mm. Y'all, because if y'all don't know what some good country eating is about. Y'all just learned. Y'all leave it to me. I'm about ready to lick this plate. But I won't do it. Because I'm going to be on camera. Forever. I'm, I'm, I'm damn near close to it, y'all. Until the next time. Don't forget to hit that like. Subscribe. And share a button. Deuces. Love y'all. Bye.